what is up you guys it is your girl the real mrs j <laughs> and y'all i've been done miss all of the action for today because i had to go into the office today so i'm on my way home right now so i'm like let me just holler at my peeps real quick because i was thinking about something People throw that word jealousy around so much in this damn sector. Every time somebody do something, it's always they jealous of the next person. Why do y'all figure that people are jealous? Or as freaking adults, you're jealous because somebody's getting more attention than you. Oh, this person jealous because you get more attention than them. Oh, you this, this person jealous because you get more numbers than them. Are you serious? Do y'all really be thinking that people be jealous for real? Like, can y'all come up with something else besides that somebody's jealous? Can y'all just speak on facts of why the person really is acting the way they acting instead of talking about damn jealousy? And, and I'm saying that because people are just like, um, yeah, MU is mad because Tracy was getting all of the attention and this and that. And I'm just saying to myself, like, why do y'all keep on saying that? Like, I, and I'm just using this as an example because this is what's going on right now. But I've heard this say, said so many times about so many different content creators. Like the content creator can do some, some F stuff to another one. And then when the person lash out, y'all say, oh, that person just jealous. Like what? Y'all use that word like so just y'all just use it too entirely too much. Like just just stop. Just stop it and call it for what it is. Like, just stop it with this bullshit, right? It's right and wrong is wrong. Now, y'all, you know, people, and I'm not taking up for, for MU, okay? I'm not taking up for her. I'm just giving y'all an observation before people start going, Oh, Miss J, you just being biased because you don't like Tracy. I don't like neither one of them, okay? Well, I didn't even say I don't like them. I don't like the things, the actions that they have displayed to me because I don't know them personally. Um, but y'all was saying that MU was jealous because Tracy was getting all of the attention and that's why she was mad. I'm confused because clearly if somebody was being not clean, not being responsible, just out here reckless on my dime, yeah, I would be frustrated too. I would have an attitude as well. I would not want to be bothered either. Okay? So I don't understand why y'all talking about some damn jealousy. I, I, I don't get it. Like, the girl had a valid reason to have an attitude. A valid damn reason. But y'all want to talk about, oh, she was jealous because she was getting all of the attention. Y'all, what the hell? So y'all just gonna act like none of this stuff. Child. And then with this money situation, while y'all keep on talking about, I'm not, um, you shouldn't pay her. Or she shouldn't have said nothing. Or she shouldn't have said this. Don't y'all know that people get unalived because they owe people money? Y'all do know that, right? So y'all think it's okay for somebody because they said something that you don't have to pay them? Yeah, let me see the judge of a court of law say something like that. Say, oh, ma'am, you don't have to pay her because, because this is what you said. And let's, let's us not forget that M.U. didn't even say nothing about the money until Tracy brought the fact up that the girl talking about she always acting like she got it like that she don't really got no money like that and that's why she came out and said something about the money and which i would have too if you would have been telling me talk talking shit about me talk about how i don't got it like that after i just damn near funded your whole freaking trip you mean to tell me that she wasn't supposed to say nothing 
Because sometimes I be wondering if y'all be listening to the same thing I'm listening to. And then furthermore, I know that Noble wants to take up for his woman, which is natural. But Noble, this really makes you look like a goddamn poop butt for real. You already was looking like a poop butt, but you look more so like a poop butt that another woman got to help your woman financially. So y'all have been planning this trip for for a while. I mean, a long time. It's been months, and you never paid your portion because y'all talking about this. Uh, it was on strike or, or something, some or due to his injury. Um, this thing been planned a long time ago. So why is it that his portion wasn't paid? That's the question. The people want to know. The people want to know why Mobile's portion wasn't paid all the way up into the trip. So you weren't going to pay for it until it was time to go on the trip? Because that's what it sounded like to me. And that's what it sounded like when, when MU said that Tracy had to borrow money from her to finish her accommodations. Hell no. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. My aunt used to always tell me, ain't no romance without finance, okay? And no man that don't have a place of his own that he can bring his woman to, not him going to his woman's place, should be out here trying to court nobody. And that's facts, okay? I know a lot of y'all don't believe in, you know, some people and they're in the more science and then this and then that they don't believe in the Bible. But one thing that the Bible says that's true that a man should have his own and he should have his own his woman should come to him not him go to his woman that's out of order that is damn out of order but hey that's their business <laughs> and this is my opinion before y'all start saying well that's their business and they happy and da 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 yeah okay Sorry, the Miss, the real Mrs. J has standards, okay? When I met my husband and when we decided to live together, I went and moved in with my husband. He didn't come and move in with me. He took care of me. He has always taken care of me. Whether my husband had to go out there and do what he had to do, he did it to take care of me. Now, there were times... If my husband was in a bind, hell yeah, I help him out. Cause that's what a help meet does. But baby, you looking like a poop butt out here, Noble. And all that shit that y'all talked about. Well, at least Noble has a job and Octavius is broke and this and that. But Kiki can go to Octavius when she needs him. Mm. Anyways, so yeah. Never go on a trip with no money never i'm not going nowhere i went out look y'all i went to atlanta in march okay and i told y'all <laughs> the real mrs j don't go nowhere without money in her pocket and her own transportation okay because it just in case if i got to drive home i'm gonna get home if i gotta get home and i'm always gonna be able to take care of me no matter where i go now when i went to be with my family yeah my family paid for a whole lot but that was because they wanted to. It wasn't because I didn't have it. That's the difference. So, yeah. this It's just crazy all the way around the damn board. And I real, really feel like they have embellished on some things with each other. Um, because, yeah. I think that they've embellished on some things. And I think, still think that they're leaving some things out. I don't expect for them to say everything. But, yeah, mm-hmm, I understand. I understand why stuff is the way it is, but, hey, I hope they can resolve it. Uh, but some people are just not meant to be friends. I, I really feel like that MU didn't want to be bothered with Tracy after the whole, when she went on the trip to California. And I think that she was just had this obligation and said that she was going to go. And she know what people were going to say if she didn't go. And I think she was trying to save face on that. Um, and that's why she still went. 
But Tracy, M, you don't like you. We already knew that. We already knew that she didn't like you. So I don't understand what part you didn't understand. Man, y'all people, y'all need to get some discernment around here. Y'all need to get some discernment. And then I'm tripping because I'm still hearing uh, Jay Wilson screaming out there ain't no friends on YouTube five and six and seven and ten times on his damn lives. But you was just damn near in tears crying because you thought Miss Cruiser knew about Sean coming and didn't tell you. Oh, my God. Look, my God today. But anyway, y'all, <laughs> that was all I wanted. Y'all can go ahead and put y'all, for the haters, y'all can go and put y'all little negative comments in there. I don't care. And I ain't going to delete it either. I'm just going to let everybody see how freaking stupid y'all are. That's why I leave comments up. <laughs> That's why I leave my comments up, baby. Because I want the rational, rational people to see how stupid you dummies look when y'all be coming over here trying to take up for fuck shit. But anyway, I love you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, The Real Mrs. J. And I will see y'all on the next video. Peace.